Hi, welcome to my channel. I'm Alison. In today's video, I want to share with you my new handmade junk journal. This junk journal, I have named it as Vintage Tangerine because of the fabric cover that has lots of tangerine, as you can see in the cover. This journal, this junk journal, have lots of sewing. I have sewed lots of the uh, pockets and page and in front of this junk journal I have sew in a pocket this pocket you can put in the tags we've come with this junk journal also you can put in some cards small letters or photos as a secret inside this journal for the first page I have put in some tuck spots you can put cards or any paper around here and for this page, this page is actually an authentic vintage magazine page. So around, I think around 1996, something, uh, 1997. So this is an authentic vintage page. And for here, I have made a tuck spot. You can put in the card, two tuck spot. You can put around here, one, and the second one around here. And I have sewed around this tuck spot here. And here I have another tuck spot also. For the next page, I leave it blank and I have pinned a small envelope over here. So you can flexibly put this envelope anywhere you want. Maybe you don't want to put it here. You can put it in another page and you have plenty of place to write down your journal and in this page this page i have do a uh, coffee dye and i have sewed in this little vintage pen and it's a flip out you can journal inside you can do any art or any pocket inside as well and here there's a tea dye red tea dye Paper. So you can see the paper is a little bit of red brown color. I like this color and I have put a tag here and this come with the journal as well and you can put it here or you can put other thing inside here and I have sold the edge so it gives more vintage look. In here have a little pocket, small pocket and some ruffles this page I have put a uh, stickers vintage stickers and I've saw a small tag lace tag beside for this page I have sewn in a flip up for uh, this is a fabric flip up so you can write either journal here or you can stick the card here I have prepared lots of cards and pockets flexible pockets and tags for for these journals as because I hope who, who have buy this they can have their creations for this uh, journal either they can stick it here okay make it as a pocket or make it as a um, tuck spot inside you so you can sew or um, actually you can glue here and then you can make it as a tuck spot or actually you can put it as a tag here also can or you want to put it in another page another project as well also this uh, card I have sew around it to make it more vintage and here is a very beautiful tea uh, coffee dye paper I like this color uh, and here have some line page coffee dye dolly paper and this is one of the vintage Chinese paper and this paper is very thin and very um, vintage as you can see some natural stain on the paper for this paper is a, a recycled paper that we have inside have some leaf as you can see some small fab fibers inside this paper I feel it's very special so I include inside and this is a craft paper brown color craft paper and here have a tab which can a magnet tab you can close it in any place and this is a vintage music paper this vintage music paper is you can if you want to become a large pocket actually you can glue it and put something up here or you can 
make it as a flip out same like this okay you can put something uh, cards or can you can journal direct on it for this page i have made a vintage i should sew a vintage pocket have a lace on top and a button on it and this you can put some tag or some letter inside here as well as also a tuck spot here at the bottom here i have do a small collage with a vintage stamp vintage authentic stamp here so i have sew on it some of the sewing i sew on the embellishment on the collage after that only i glue inside so that it will don't affect the next page for this one is also a small collage and there's a metal uh, metal braids here here beside this edge i have put i have sew in some lace to make it feel more vintage and more girly and here have a very pretty floral sticker a flip up and lace here actually for this flip up there's a line here you can tear it into half here you can tear it into half if you don't have a long one and down there you can write down your journal and you can cover it here has a pocket you can put some cards inside and decorate the pocket and this one is a authentic vintage children's dictionary a tuck spot here sewing tuck spot some coffee dye paper and here has a vellum paper behind the vellum paper have a butterfly encyclopedia in the middle of the page i have a uh, tape so that you won't see the line the tracks come out i feel this is more beautiful and neatly so i have covered it here another page of the coffee dye paper and in this pocket i have do some collage and i have includes one handmade tag bookmark tag you can put it anywhere for now i have put it in here actually in this you can still write down and behind you also can write some secrets behind this is another side of the pocket you can put anything inside maybe some of you you can put uh, some tickets or some receipts inside this is a tag with i have put a floral lace up here and i have pinned it over here this is a vellum paper pocket in this pocket i have do some fabric collage with this with these stamps and i have put in a paper for you to write if you you can change this for any others like cards or any others tag something like this one also can or you can put anything inside the next page is this line uh, line craft paper this coffee dye paper and there's a collage over here you can make it as a tuck spot you can tuck in something or some card some letter some paper some postcard also can vintage uh, book, story books paper vintage music paper and here there's a small pocket for the tuck spot and i have put in lace and a little b here and also i put a pin you can pin in anything here this is a tuck spot where i have do some collage you can put in here or you can either flip up to write chinese paper and here have a little bird collage with this pretty floral lace and a button here another tuck spot this tuck spot i have include a uh, sewing paper sewing story book paper and this one is a real authentic postcard which i have collects uh, so you can write in front or behind or you can do some collage in this pocket this vellum coffee dye pocket i have sewed around this 
paper and this is a very beautiful let me take up and show you this is a very beautiful coffee dye paper that i very i like a lot and i've included a, a paper on it so you can either you can pin it here or you can move to another place actually different paper they give up different color coffee dye effects like this one is darker color and this one is more milky color and i like the effect as well you can see the patterns over here this is very original and very unique in this pocket this sew pocket i have include a sewing letter paper you can write and put it into here you can write on it and this is another page of the red tea dye paper and i have collage a little bird collage here and a flip out pocket here flip flip out little mini envelope inside the envelope i have included a small card here behind the envelope is a tuck spot where you can put in anything some right uh, some type paper blank paper and this is a fabric collage paper in front of it is actually a fabric you can put your photo or any embellishment on it and behind you can collage with it i feel it's very nice if you put a photo and you write about something about this photo and i've included some small journaling card and bottom here i have do a washi ruffles and here has another pocket i have included inside coffee dye paper, the cute bear sticker, the authentic vintage magazine paper and lastly here is the last page. Around this book I also have put some metals so that it will be more stronger when you use it and I also include this postcard envelope. In this envelope I have do some collage, some uh, vintage ribbon. In this pocket i will include some of the journal cards some embellishment that i've made for the journaling that you would include to receive in front of this envelope is also another pocket i have made this include inside here that's another pocket so i hope you like my video today if uh, i will link below all the details all the in my description box so if you have any other uh, questions you may private message me for all the details and i hope you like today's video and i will see you again bye bye